G'day everyone, Connor here from CW's Tech Reviews, back again with another video. Today we're having a look at Lineage ROM for the Galaxy S7. So this is the official download. I'm going to go in, check it out, and uh, we'll see what all the fuss is about. So I'm just booting into Twerp, that's the first thing you're going to have to do. There we go, I'm going to wipe, advanced wipe, Dalvik system data cache. Some people are laughing at how I say cache, 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 cache me outside. Anyway, install Lineage OS 14th of March, nightly. Boom. Hopefully this doesn't take too long. If it does, I'll pause it so we don't have to uh, sit here and just stare at the screen, but it's going pretty quickly. Now, what ROM do you use? What's your favorite ROM? For your Galaxy S7 or do you think you don't need to reach your phone and put a custom ROM on? I personally love it. Alright now that's done I'm going to wipe cache. Go back to home, choose install. Open gaps ARM64 7.1. Swipe. Now this one will take a little bit longer than um, the ROM itself so I'll, I'll pause it now and I'll come back to you shortly. For you, it'll be like half a second. Usual story with all this, guys. It wipes everything from your device, so it's a risk you take, and it also might brick your device. Again, a risk you take. I'm not up for it. If your device, if you, if you uh, brick your device, then that's your problem. Wipe cache, swipe, back to home, reboot system. We'll come back when it's all booted. Again, it's going to be half a second for you lot. There's the boot screen for Lineage ROM, official Lineage ROM. All right, everyone, here we go. Just running through initial setups of Lineage ROM and initial testing, and everything looks pretty smooth so far. One of the things is the camera could be a little bit better, but people online are saying it's actually worse than what it is. I actually think it's quite, quite impressive, and I'd be more than happy using this. I'll take it down the beach tomorrow and test it out. It looks pretty good to me. I'm not having any forced closes or anything like that. Um, you've got your stock sort of Google or Android software. It's not got the Pixel, um, what do you call it, Pixel um, launcher in, attached to it. It's just your stock lineage ROM. If you go into the settings, you've got some uh, basic um, changes there in the settings. Like here, you can change your status bar change the clock, battery style, all that sort of thing. Uh, if I go to the home screen, hold down, you've got your settings in here that you can adjust it all with. Uh, go back to here, you've got your widgets. So, really nice, really smooth. I didn't have any problems with it at all. Great ROM. Get behind the developers, get in there, get amongst it. Definitely worth downloading. If you've got any questions about the ROM, hit me up in the comments below. Also, let me know what you're rocking on your phone, or you're using stock, whatever. Just let me know and we'll, um, we'll check it all out and flash lots of ROMs and all that sort of thing. So, thanks for watching. Catch us in the next one. Check ya.